Prophetess Inka Uluguenga, a former senior member of the Synagogue Church of All Nations, Skoan, thank God for meeting the founder of the Glorious Light International Church. Sharing a photo of herself with the founder of Glorious Light International Church, Bishop Abraham Simama and his wife, on Instagram on Tuesday, January 4, Prophetess Inka thanked the God of Tibi Joshua for bringing them to our life. God of Tibi Joshua never forsakes me always. He's a faithful God. He knew a time like this would come when I would need good, informed, and inspired people to continue my journey in life. And he made me meet these great men and women of God with a large heart, she captioned. Prophetess Sinka, as she is known for short, also promises to explain how the couple touched her life. I will show more of them very soon and explain how they all touched my life through my mentor. Brethren, whatever you are doing today, please let us do good. Treat others the way you wish to be treated, and the one you serve in the secret will surely reward you in the open. God, I am thankful and grateful. Undeserved grace, she wrote. This comes after being hosted by Abraham Simama and his wife on several occasions in Malawi in their church, Glorious Light International Church, which also includes Christmas Day and Crossover Night, alongside Prophetess Anne. Prophetess Anne had also shared a photo of herself on Instagram on Monday, January 3, embracing Bishop Simama and his wife as her new mother and father in the Lord, as she encouraged her new father to keep pressing in God's name and in God's ways. God has gifted me with another mother, a virtuous, gentle, kind, loving, and peaceable woman. Seeing her alone brings calmness to my spirit. My new mama in Malawi love her so much, she described her new mama. Prophetesses Yinka and Anne were disciples of Skoan founder, Professor B. Joshua, who died on June 5, 2021. They left the Nigerian mega church after Joshua's wife, Evelyn Joshua, emerged as a new leader in September 2021.